Hello, it's Janie, um, aka Porter Peach. How's everyone today? I'm going to do a um, Ulta haul today. Have a little bit of um, a few things. I have some EOS, some NYX, some Tarte, and um, a um, Ulta eye makeup palette. So we'll get started because I have quite a bit of stuff to show you. Um, the first thing I got was this EOS hand lotion. And, um, oh, what kind is this? Strawberry something. Berry Blossom. It's in Berry Blossom. I just got it because it's in a little cute pink container. But it does smell. It smells really good. And um, I have used these lotions before, and they are very moisturizing, so I like to have these in my purse. I also picked up the EOS Lip Balm in Strawberry Sorbet. Smells really good, and I do have several of these little balms throughout the house, by my bed, in my bathroom, in my purse, just everywhere so I can have those um, to put on my lips. Whew, I'm out of breath. I've been cleaning the house, and I thought, well, I'm going to stop and um, do a video, and I hope you may be able to hear my washing machine in the background. I don't know. Maybe. But anyway, sorry if you can. Um, let's get started with the NYX. I haven't had this brand before, so I was real excited to be able to go in. They had some had it on sale. I think it was like buy one, get one 50% off or something like that. Because this has been a while since I purchased these items. But the blush that I picked up is called Pinched. She looks like, like that right there. And it's just a really nice, soft pink color with a little bit of hint of coral in it which looks like that just really pretty and then I did pick up a few of the single eyeshadows and um, this one is in toffee shimmer just this right here just a white almost a white but with just a hint a hint of beige in it, I guess. See right there. Just a almost kind of a gold color, but it's right there. And I got rust, just this color here. And This color right there, which is rust. True taupe. This one's true taupe. There. Again, it's just just a basic brown, um, almost like a clay color. So where do I want to swatch this at? Oh, I'm running out of room. That's that one right there. That's True Taupe. I figured that would be a really pretty um, crease color right there. And then the other single one I got was Iced Mocha. I tried to just, the, for the first time out, to maybe pick like some neutral colors. I'm going to make it white here. I'm going to clean my hand off. Um, just to kind of see how they work on my eyes. Kind of color payoff they have, how well they blend, that type thing, since I haven't used them before. <clears throat> and also, I think some of these colors were mentioned a lot on um, YouTube. And this one's Iced Mocha, which is right there. I can't remember if I showed that to you. And it is just a mocha color right there. And I did pick up some of their eyeshadow palettes. Um, this one is called Love in Florence, Eat, Love, Be Fab. Eat, Love, Be Fab. Oop, that's got a glare. I liked it because it had this, this really, really pretty green color in there. Oops. I haven't opened these yet. I didn't see that. Right there. 
I want those to be really we'll swatch them. Those are the colors right there. Love this green. I think that is so pretty. And then let's see. If we can get them all swatched on here. To where you can see them. And that's what they swatch out at. This is really pretty. I really like this this peach color here and the green. Really pretty. And then one of the other ones that I got, it was another Love and Florence line, but this one's called Bellini Kiss. Get this open. And there's those colors there. I have a gold and a bronze, a peach color. So those colors right there. Swatch those. Really pretty for spring. Spring and summer. And then the last NYX eye palette I got is the Love in Paris. And this one's called Jane Say qua. I don't know how to pronounce that. Maybe you can see. It's in French, I would assume. Can't pronounce it. Let's see, does that have a seal? Nope. Okay. And this is just a quad, <clears throat> not quad, but just a palette of different colors, neutrals. That'd be fun to play with. I'll just kind of swatch a few of these. There's just the three, the three colors here. That's those. That's kind of a, um, the purple, kind of a, um, a light bronzy color and then I'd like a taupe. That's what that one is. And I also picked up this Tarte High Performance Naturals Amazon Escape Palette. So Just in like, like, it looks like a little clutch. It's got this little texture and like the faux snake skin design there. This little clasp. You just open up. And in it, it's got. Um, some eyeshadows and some blushes. We'll do the blushes first. They are called Free and Exposed. Right there. Just those there. Just a pink, almost a coral, a dark coral color, and then a um, a brownish color. Almost you could almost maybe use this. For a bronzer, it might be too red though. Then you just have some neutral colors in your palette. Here, my washer is getting ready to take off. Right there. Ooh, these have a lot of. I'm not used any of the um, the Tarte eyeshadows. So yes, they do have a lot of pigment to those. And these are, this one is called, um, let's see if I can get this right, Tribal, Camo, and Rare is what those are called. And then the other ones are called Canopy, Rope, and Tame. Canopy, Rope, and Tame. Now, I don't know if these are available individually. Because, like I said, I've not used any Tarte um, eyeshadows before. So, that's why I picked it up. I thought, well, get a palette, and that way I could try a whole bunch of different shadows and blush 
for a, um, a good price. I think this was like $38, $42. So when you break it down, you know, with six eyeshadows and two blushes, that was pretty reasonable. And then the last thing that I picked up was at the Ulta store was their, their um, spring uh, limited edition called Gorgeous on the Go 61 piece collection. And you open it up. I don't know if I can get all this. But it has. Gosh, it has all these eyeshadows, lip glosses, brushes, um, the little sponge applicators on this end. Try to get the glare off of there. And then on the other end is um, more eyeshadows. And each of the eyeshadows has a blush in it also. So you have all these blushes. And one of those was missing because it's actually in this little container that you get with it. This little pouch. You snap in your little um, eyeshadow palette that maybe you used that day and you want to take this with you for touch-ups. And then you have a place here to put your brushes. And then there's a little mirror right there. How cute was this? And this was on clearance. This is $175 value, and it was on clearance or on sale for $19.99. So I thought, well, for $19.99, it's worth a try when you're getting all of this product. Oh, and there's some eyeliners in here also. I didn't see those. And these are double-ended eyeliners. So there's a color. There's a color on each end. On each end. This would be actually would make a really good kit for someone that was just starting out to wear makeup or wanting to start out their collection. Just trying to get one of these out because we're going to swatch some of these. And I've not used the Ulta eyeshadows either, so I don't know what kind of pigment they have, what kind of color payoff, how well they blend, what kind of fallout they have. But for $20 and you get all these colors to play with, you know, it was worth it. And that's, that's that palette there. And this one's just some grays and blues, and this one's actually called the Smoky, the Smoky palette. Is that there? And then the um, blush in it is called Sweet Cheeks. Sweet Cheeks, right there. That's a really pretty soft pink. Soft pink. I'm not going to go through all these because I'm not going to have time. It would probably be kind of boring anyway. This one's called In Bloom. And it has all these different spring bright colors. <clears throat> also in this kit, which was pretty neat, was a, um, a coupon for $5 off a $10 purchase. And this, this is valid. This is not good until the end of May through the middle of June. So it's not one, you know, sometimes you buy palettes and things and you get a coupon in them and they're already expired. This one's actually going to be still good. If I remember to use it, I'm really bad about forgetting to use my coupons. I need to quit doing that. I need to use my coupons. Let's see. This has got a really pretty pink and green purple. It's really pretty for spring. It's really pretty. These actually seem like they're going to have a really good color payoff. And they swatched really well. So pretty. I really like this green and purple right there. Those would be pretty together. Let's see, and then there was, of course, you know, there's some fall colors in here, spring colors, neutrals, cool colors, warm colors, so it's, it's a little bit of everything that anybody would need except for your foundation and mascara. I was trying to get those glosses out, but I can't get it out. Oh, it won't come out. Oh. <laughs> there, got one. This one's called Poppy. It's a 
the Ulta Super Shiny, just a little doe foot applicator. Just a nice sheer, sheer lip gloss, nothing too bright. So again, this would make a great kit for someone that's just getting started out wearing makeup or that's wanting to start their collection for a very reasonable price. And I bought this probably about three weeks ago, so I, I don't know if they still have them available or not, but you could look online and see if they have them. Again, it's called the Ulta Gorgeous On The Go 61-piece um, collection. That is all I have for now, so um, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and appreciate it, and talk to you later. Bye.